Hi, hi, and my name is Tobias, and welcome to this first ever broadcast here on Periscope uh, called Unconventional Wisdom Live. <laughs> uh, just give you a minute or a second to join uh, while I introduce this idea. The idea that I'm having is that uh, two to three times a week I'll share like a freestyle, a spontaneous session on an important topic, like for example, art or music, uh, self-expression, different important topics like that. And today I'm going to speak about art. It's just to give you one more uh, minute to join. So um, how this will work is here on Periscope you can follow me and uh, you can comment, you can heart and I hope you enjoy what I have to say. And also I'll put up a replay on YouTube so if you watch it there you can comment under there and I will be joining there and reading so that you can actually uh, suggest new words and topics to talk about. So this is like a positive freestyle, uh, okay, it doesn't, it doesn't rhyme, but kind of like a freestyle. Today we're going to speak about art and the value of art. Um, I saw this great quote online and uh, I think it was either by President Roswell or uh, Winston Churchill, um, somebody who was a leader in government during World War II. And um, when he was asked if he wants to like change the funding that he and his government are giving to arts, if he wants to change that into uh, get more fundings for military and for weapons, he was like, I will not do that because art is important for society. It's like, if we don't fight for art, what is it we're fighting for? And that is a quite, quite a bold statement and I like that really much because it speaks so much about the value of art because obviously there's two kind of people, the artists and then there is people who are not artists, who don't use art as a form of self-expression. Maybe uh, working in an office or being a technician or um, working in health and things like that. But uh, for all others, <laughs> all of us who are creatives at heart and who struggle maybe with self-expressions and all we hear all the time is that oh, we should rather get a real proper job because art you can't live off that I mean just think about it all of you who maybe are not artists but all of you you probably watch movies you listen to music you all enjoy different forms of art obviously I'm not asking you to support and, and enjoy all kind of arts and all kind of artists, all art forms. That's not the point. The point is more that um, support the ones that you like and go a little extra to support like new started artists or people around you who wants to, who wants to make a living with art. Like I've heard all my life that I wanted to be like a musician and travel the world and encourage people since I was like maybe eight or nine years old. And I've heard all my life, you can't make a living of that, you can't be serious even considering that. How crazy is that? I mean, think about how if everybody would be a bit more supportive, not download videos or music for free online, and uh, not just on Spotify or other places where artists don't get so much money out of it. I mean, buy things from artists, support artists that are around you, that you like. It's really that easy, because then it would be... if. If other people are more encouraging towards artists, then artists are more encouraged. Quite simple. And obviously, if you are like newly uh, or a newly started artist or somebody who hasn't really done much, but you have like this message on your inside, that's what I'm talking about. That is something that you need to express and you need to let out, let, yeah, go, <laughs> bring it, give birth to it. Really, it is really, really important that you do that. That little small inner voice in you, that is the one that is the most important one when it comes to art. It's kind of self-expression and self-confidence through art. And if you are somebody who struggles with that, you should really be bold and do it anyway. Overcome the fear and just go and do it. All right, that's my encouraging word for today. <laughs> I hope you like it and have a great day. I'll see you next time. Leave a comment to what I should talk about next. Thank you.